on my camera. So welcome back to my channel. I look like a potato. Um, my shirt's wet, but it's just wet because I wash my face. So I don't think anything crazy. Um, my sister gave me like 15 minutes to get ready. Right now, so I'm about to be ready. And I'm gonna be doing my regular foundation that I always do. My I'm just gonna get ready. Ooh, 90%. So I'm gonna be getting ready and using like all the products I use every single day. Um, try to get ready as soon as I can. That way my camera doesn't die. Um, but yeah, so basically it's just like a foundation routine type of thing. So I have to like hurry up and get ready. And by the way, update on the lashes. I really think that they're growing. I didn't take the four pictures because I'm done. But I don't know if you guys can see, they're like very, very, I don't know, they're nice. Okay, so for my primer, I've been using my, I can find it, my Tatcha Silk Canvas. Um, this thing. And it's literally the best ever. I apply it. Oh, I forgot the moisturizer. So I'm just gonna put moisturizer on first. And avoid that area where I already put that on. I'm gonna hurry, sorry. I don't want my camera to die. And my hair is a mess. This is how I wake up. Sorry, guys. Um, anyway, so I'm gonna be applying that Tatcha Silk Canvas on the areas where I have big ugly pores and my camera's gonna die so I hope it doesn't because it's so sad and I got it on my hair oh my god I'm just so put together so then I'm gonna go on this side I think I'm actually gonna get I didn't think I was going to film this, but my friends asked me to film it, so I um, a wet night sponge. And I don't use a beauty blender anymore, I use the Real Techniques, which is super dirty, but I'm disgusting. So I'm just going to go with it today. I'll wash it tonight or something. Um, And if you hear that noise, I always leave the fan on in the restroom. I don't know why. Right now, I'm using the Forever Decor. Uh, what is this called? Forever Decor Foundation. 24 hour wear foundation. And I have the color. W0, which is a little pink for me, and I'm very olive. But, put it on. Who cares what we look like today? I'm just trying to get this video before my camera dies. Now that you look like you have shit all over your face. When I can't decide and the fear leaves me blind, you always will eat me through. If you need me, you look at my brows, I'm like they're creepy looking. There's nothing that I wouldn't do. Put it all out in the open, no, we don't have to control it. Put it all out in the open. If it's only it's a lifetime of emotions Put it all out in the open I got my mom this foundation It's the um Come on 
And it's like, it's called like a youthful something. It looks so good on her. Like, she looks like ten years younger. It was crazy. Like very glowy. Not one for our glowy foundation because I'm super glowy, but this foundation is glowy, and I just try to set it very well because they do get away a lot throughout the day. Just try to set the spot where I get the This looks like skin, so I love that. Mm -hmm. I try to put a little more in the areas where I need it more. Put it all out in the open. Now we don't just look really good and healthy. So I like that. So I that double chin. All done with my foundation. See how much healthier your skin looks? So yeah, one of my favorites. Now I'm gonna go in with my Born This Way concealer. And what I like to do is, this is almost the same shade. So it's not like a big deal. With a little bit more coverage, though. And then I take my shape tape and light sand. And pretty much mix the colors, I guess, so it's a little lighter. And then glow your. Look crazy in the mirror. I don't know if you can see take my old beauty blender that I don't use anymore that's really ugly um, and just My brow pencil by Benefit. Um, like it says, it's really precise. I wish I had a free. Okay, we have eight percent, so I'm gonna skip this whole brow thing, um, and then I'll show you guys the rest of my face. So now that I look like an angry bird, uh, I go in with my concealer, um, and I've been using this concealer for like six or seven years. It's the, um, I don't know what it's called, it's by MAC, it's this little thing. Um, and I just go underneath my brows and clean that up because I need to look not like 
because looking like an angry bird is not the vibe. Maybe another day. Not today. Okay. And then once that, I take one of my brushes, either this one's from Sephora or this one's from Sigma. Um, I take the charcoal one and just clean that up. So it's not too crazy looking. I think is hard work. I don't know that. So now that I still look like an angry bird and more put together, I'm all done with that. I take my dirtiest bronzer brush. I'm the bronzer, which is the Kat Von D. I've been using this forever. I take the lightest shade and just control with that. Sometimes I use my Marc Jacobs one, but I don't love that one like too much. Today we're using this one. I might have the charge of the chat. But we're at 6%. I don't know if I think it's gonna be good. This is never gonna be good. Well, I'm not going to. If you guys don't follow my sister on Instagram, you should. She's super cool. And she posts like a cook shit that is really good. And all those other home decor stuff. So I'll put her Instagram handle somewhere here. I'm literally look like a bronzed. A burnt chicken nugget. Kind of. For the most part. Uh, we're gonna take our brush and take away all that baking. Powder and just take it off. The next step is I use my Jaclyn Hill Becca palette. I don't know I take the champagne pop shade because I broke my other one. Um, and I like, put on the brush on here and just. If you need me at the wrong time, do it all up. Put it on here and then mix it. I'm not wearing my lighter for a little while, but I'm back on it. Don't know why. I just sometimes don't feel the need to wear it. I don't contemplate this. Every time I do that, I look. When I take my Becca um, Chrissy Teigen palette and I get this shade here. I kind of blend that into. For my eyes. My weird percentage is gonna be Hold on, let me charge it. We still have 5%, but I charged it just a little. So we're gonna be going in with my shade in my eye palette by Kat Von D. That's where I always use on my eyes for this look that I do every day. Uh, I go in with this shade here and I just put that on my creams. I kind of straighten my hair when my camera was uh, I kind of straighten my hair while my camera was charging a little bit just so I can curl it. Oh, 
tonight I found something in your chair Man, I'm by the roadside, wait up for me I'd go anywhere that you do Put it all out in the open, now we don't have to control it Put it all out in the open I'm using the darker shade on my crease also, kind of bringing it lower into my lid. I'm doing the same on this lid. So literally that's all I have. Use three colors every day, same color. Sometimes I get a little printer, um, but for the most part it's great. I also like doing like purple leaves. And then we're gonna be using that same one that I used for my on the lid. And that just gives it a bit of a shimmer. It all about the And literally that's it. Next step is mascara, and that's the final step. So if my camera dies, my lashes are growing, guys. Like. And I got mascara all over my hand. Um, yeah, so that's the last step. Um, I'm just gonna curl my hair and then I'll get back to my camera. Okay, I'm all done with my hair. I charge my camera, it's like at 6%. Anyway, um, so the next step basically after I do all my makeup, my mascara, and everything, I use my fresh sugar lip polish um, and I rub my lips with it so that they're nice and fresh. First, sponsor me because I love this stuff. I'll fast forward this part. Remember tonight, I found something here with you. And then my last step is I've been using Velvet Teddy on my lips every single day. Um, this is one of my favorite lipsticks. It's very old, probably moldy, but I'm still wearing it. Put too much because I don't like how that looks when there is too much um, lipstick. That's another thing. Ever since I got my lips done, like lipstick for me wasn't like a thing anymore. Like I didn't really enjoy lipstick that much. So yeah, that's it. I'm gonna spray some style illuminate on my hair to make it shiny and healthy looking. And I'll see you guys in a little bit. For this top um, and these high waisted jeans, um, I think I might wear my hair looks crazy. I think I'm gonna have to fix that. Um, but I think I'm gonna wear my small D necklace and my Pisces necklace. So I'm gonna try those on. Um, hope you guys can see me. I'm gonna take the tags off of this and you can kind of see my bra. Shit. I should like take it off. Okay, so I'm putting my cute little Pisces necklace and my D necklace, which I love so much. There. And then we're 
my D necklace. I take it off sometimes at night because it chokes the shit out of me. Fixed my bra real fast. I'll be right back. So I changed my bra and now I don't look crazy. So I have to take the tag off. And I probably will rip these off in a second. I just don't know what shoes to wear. I was thinking some tennis shoes, but I only have like two pairs. I love this outfit. Like, I don't even want to show you guys because I am so dirty. But it's like just the trendiest, cutest outfit ever. Um, yeah, this is my makeup look. It's a little oily already, like I said. Um, but I like it. It's cute. And my camera's about to die. So thank you guys so much for watching. If you're new here, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys on my next video. Time, throw it all out by the wayside There's no